Today is the last week of classes. I also have to go into campus. I have one class and I have to go into the lab to discuss the summer project that I'm doing um, for the internship. But yeah, it snowed overnight, like an insane amount. It was raining, like pouring rain all day yesterday. And then I guess it snowed all night. Um, so yeah, it's all snowy. I'm gonna leave earlier for my commute. Just got ready, I'm gonna pack my bag now, make a coffee, and then head for campus. I got the package that I've been waiting for and I already opened it because I was so eager but it's from Madame Glam New York so they're a nail polish company so I got one of like the lights that you dry your nails with and you use to like seal the nails they sent me five different colors and I'm so excited I painted my nails stop biting them so they look look so bad they look like a five-year-old's nails but i'm so excited to do this because i have like tips from like walmart and i'm gonna paint them so i got these five colors and then a top coat and a base coat and i'm gonna try them out now i'm not even gonna wait for tomorrow i'm just gonna do them right now what makes madame glam so good is that they're vegan they're cruelty free and they're 21 free so they're free of the 21 like really bad chemicals that are in typical nail polishes and like different polishes for your nails so that's why I was so excited because they're vegan and cruelty free and they're not like as toxic as a lot of the other nail care brands are or like nail polish brands are. So I got these five colors. Okay, so I got Vanilla Sky, which was the purple. So that's the purple that I chose. And then I got a pink color. So it's called Soft Pink, which is kind of like that and then i got a nude color called cream silk which is like that and then i got a blue called glorious the blue i really wanted to try a blue because i feel like it's really like chic for especially for paris so i'm i kind of really want to try this but i don't know if i'm going to try it today or do like kind of a nude um and then i know it's not christmas get up but i got christmas essence which is like the red i was really going for like a cherry red um a lot of their reds were sold out but this is kind of like the closest i got to the cherry red so yeah i got five different colors i went for like kind of two springy colors which is like the pink and the purple a nude just for like all the time and then two like winter um fall colors because i really love like a red and then they also sent me like a top coat and a base coat so i think i'm gonna do those i'm gonna, I'm gonna do it now i'm so excited to try them
here are the nails. This is how they turned out. I decided on the blue color because I don't know, I just feel like they're super cute. Um, so yeah, these are how they turned out. I really do love them. They were super easy to do and the light made them dry super fast. Um, but yeah, they're super durable. I honestly really love the color and uh, yeah, I can't wait to like continue to do them. But anyway, so I am officially done all my classes for third year. Um, my exams start a week today, or a week yesterday, sorry. So I have like a week to prepare for my first exam, then they go all the way until like almost the end of April. So I'm taking today as like kind of like a break from any schoolwork because I finished all my notes, all my assignments, everything is submitted. Um, all the coursework is done. So I'm taking this day before I start actually studying for my exams. I'll start that tomorrow. Um, but yeah, I've just been like crocheting a little bit and watching some Paris vlogs, like kind of preparing for my summer abroad. Um, so yeah, that's kind of what I'm doing now. So I started a new crochet project today because last night I finished my previous one. Um, this is like my very first crochet project that I've ever done. And I'm pretty proud i think it looks good for like the very first one ever i still have to block it and like steam it and stuff but it's kind of like just a tote bag i'm thinking of bringing it to paris but i don't know for sure because i don't want to like ruin it but i just did like granny squares and then i sewed them together so it's kind of like what it looks like up close oh my nails kind of match a little bit but yeah so i'm just gonna keep crocheting and watch some vlogs this is kind of just like my relaxed day like a, kind of gonna take a break um so yeah i might do a little bit of reviewing and like preparing for my studying later tonight but right now i'm just like taking a break yesterday so yesterday i basically did absolutely nothing i fully just watched netflix and watched youtube and crocheted and read the entire day i didn't do any schoolwork and i felt like i needed that like buffer day like between the last day of classes and the first day i start studying so today i'm going to start studying um i've already kind of gone over all of my all of the material for all of my classes that I have an exam for. So I have four exams this semester. Um, I wanted, I thought I would only have three, but um, my architecture class does have an exam. So I thought it wasn't going to, but it does. So I have four exams instead of three, um, but that's fine. It's not like too hard. It's the easiest one I have, but it's still an exam and I have to study for it, which sucks, but um, so I'm going to start on, so the architecture one is my first one. Um, it's this week. So I'm going to start on my immunology um, topic sheets and then my flashcards for my architecture class today. And then I'm going to start with for my physiology and like nutrition, nutrition, athletics, performance, behavior class um, probably tomorrow. So I'm going to get those all done the topic sheet so that way once it's like time to study for them I already have all the information in my head and like I'm familiar with the content so that's what I'm gonna do today for the for my immunology class and for my architecture class 
oh my gosh and it's not even it's not even that early it's like 10 o'clock i'm so so tired and these last few weeks of classes took it out of me i had so many assignments due and like i had to go to classes because a lot of them weren't recorded so it's just like so exhausting the last few weeks and i'm just so happy to be done and now it's midterms and sorry exams so now it's exams and i have to start studying so that's what i'm gonna start today and then um and then yeah like my full out studying probably tomorrow so yeah so i just made my coffee i'm gonna read my book I'm reading, reading, I'm reading this book, um, A Court of Silver Flame, Sarah J. Mass. It's definitely the thickest one and it's definitely the slowest one, I feel like. I kind of loved A Court of Mist and Fury, um, so I'm kind of just like comparing it and I know I shouldn't because it's like two different characters, but yeah, this is what I'm reading right now. I think it's pretty good. I'm not that far into it. I'm like 300 pages in, so... I have to keep keep reading along for that one because I want to start um, like new books for my summer abroad. I'm gonna read and then I'm gonna start. 